Welcome to Go Okanagan. Right now, we are in the parking lot of the Summerland Arena and Curling Club. And as you can see, it's time for Summerland Action Festival Parade. This is where all the floats and the bands and all the people are gathering to get ready for this uh, great, great parade. And that's what we'll be bringing to you on today's show, plus some of the action and fun over in the park. Well, all the floats and groups are getting ready here for the Summerland Action Festival Parade. And now we're talking to Barrett from the, the Healthcare Auxiliary here in Summerland. That's right. Now, you said this organization has been around for a long time. A long time, since 1909. Wow, that's amazing. It is. Now talk a little bit about what your group does. Well, we um, provide fundraising activities right. in support of health care in the South Okanagan. Our biggest uh, fundraiser is the thrift shop over on North Victoria. Right. And I am very proud to say that we've raised over four and a half million dollars in what? support of health care in uh, South Okanagan since inception. Four and a half million dollars. That's crazy. All volunteers. We're looking for Summerland volunteers. We always are needing new volunteers. So just come over to the shop on Victoria and uh, we'll get you going. Look at that, the Summerland School of Dance warming up, getting ready for the parade. So hang on one second, guys. Can I can I barge in and interrupt your performance? So so are you looking forward to the parade? Yes. How hard is it to change your dance routine that you're used to doing on a stage to, to now having to do it as you're going down like a road? Not as hard as you think. No, is it, so it's pretty straightforward? Yeah. We're going to hit switch to the other song and see a little bit of that as, as they get ready because the parade's going to get started pretty quick here. Everybody that couldn't be here to see the parade, this is what you're missing if you don't come out to the Summerland Action Festival Parade. Well, you don't see an elephant in a parade in Summerland every day, but there you go. And now we're talking to Brenda from the One Person Project, which is a really amazing uh, undertaking here in Summerland, right? Yes, we've been around since 2006. Um, One Person Project supports a dist uh, district in Tanzania and we support the district by bringing teams of volunteers over to Tanzania on a yearly basis, self-funded trips. We bring teachers, medical staff, and, um, and volunteer in the area, and we also ship containers. It's the first time in the parade, but we thought it was a good opportunity to, to promote our next fundraiser, which is next Saturday at our at Home Hardware in Penticton. Oh, okay. At our container, we're having everybody bring their bottles down to donate them to help finish our orphanage. And now tell me a little bit about Shasta. Well, Shasta is a miniature I got from a rescue farm in Princeton. Oh, okay. And we've just uh, added her to our little entourage at the Red Barn Ranch. And uh, we've spent the last year, me and my friend Chloe here, training her to drive a buggy. Oh, and we, this is her first appearance in a parade. Now we're uh, catching up to the Cadillac containing Katie Grant, Miss Action Fest. Have you ever been in a parade before? Yeah, but I've never got to ride in one. I've normally had to walk. So uh, talk a little bit about the, the pageant and, and how that's been going for you. It's really good. It was a fun experience. All right. Uh, we're holding up the works here, so we got to let Katie roll. Well, have a great parade. Let's see your wave. Very nice. <laughs> 